In this short video, I was invited by my friend from Swaziland. Um, Bongi is a pilot in the military there. And he told me, dude, just fly down. Um, I, need, I need you to fly with me a little bit. And uh, he invited me to come down and just see him. And I did. And I got there. And uh, he's 150. Yeah? His Charlie 150 was ready when I got there. So we decided to do a short flight across um, the country. And uh, it was a bumpy ride. <laughs> the weather had changed upon us. The, it was very windy. But nonetheless, it was a good um, time out and I enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoyed this short video as well. Um, there's no ATC in it, there's no audio in it because the trick I tried to grab the ATC audio from that video did not work as planned. So the ATC audio is rather very very faint and annoying so I wouldn't put it in there I'd rather just overlay it with music uh, well yeah I hope there will be improvement in future videos of this nature all right so I'm in Pretoria at the what's this hospital it used to be called the Tea Company of Mary uh, in Hruncliffe um, yeah Mike said these guys are quick they can get you a result in around uh, 24 hours because most of the companies in the job will promise you turnaround time of between 36 and 48 hours and while that's still good for my Friday departure my problem is the time of collection of the results because I would need to have them by Thursday if possible that's tomorrow if possible if I have them tomorrow even if it's just before close of business that should be fine that allows me to depart extremely early on Friday I hate you know driving east at sunrise or driving west at sunset it's just not good for my eyes so let's see what the um gonna manage to pull off you know um i've never really done a covid test i know i've had people say something is uh, inserted into your nose and yeah um i'm just gonna have to deal with that because i need this certificate and this actually made me think you know maybe the vaccine is not such a bad thing one should perhaps consider just doing it once and for all to avoid this endless um, poking of the nose each time one needs to travel but we'll see the we'll thing that made me choose this guy is, is when i checked online the promise there was that they work 24 7 and i left the house around half past six so i was here at seven o'clock um I've been doing, you know, going around, I've been sent from pillar to post. There are many laboratories here in this hospital. And these specific guys, I don't know what lab, uh, you know, what, I, what, what lab name they, they, they go with, but um, they don't start, they don't, they don't work 24 7. They start at 8 o'clock. So I've had to wait for 8 o'clock um, before they could, uh, you know, give me the test. But I'm going to stick with them because they are. A little bit fast compared to the mainstream laboratories that are inside the hospital itself. Today I am in um, the country of Swaziland, formerly known as Swaziland in today's, yeah, formerly known as Swaziland, today called as Swatini. I am at uh, Matsapa International Airport in Manzini, Swaziland. Well, I came to check a friend of mine here and uh, we are going to take off to uh, just fly towards the east of Swaziland, uh, low level flying. Operating time approximately one hour and then we back to Matsapa. My co-pilot for today is uh, my good friend and Cape Town Ubongi. Ubongi say hi to the people. Hi people. Uh -huh. So today we're going to fly east. Um, I can see the mountains we're going to be flying over. The Drakensberg range there. 
Lubo- Lubombo Mountains, right? We're going to be flying very close to that, and then we're going to come back. We're going to be overflying a dam in the east. Um, are we going to go to the other airport, the big one, uh, Skupe? Yeah, we have to. Yeah. Okay, we'll overfly Skupe. We might not land, just do touch and... Um, sorry, we just do a go around, and then we come back to Matsapa. Uh, talk to you again once we're airborne.
that was a useful video to you i hope it was entertaining and if it was please do click the like button below do not forget to subscribe and to ask your fellow aviators and fellow aspiring aviators to subscribe as well and to share the link in the uh you know a community of aviators because it's only when we spread the word it's only when we um, communicate this to others that you can make Africa great again because each one teach one that should be what drives us in the spirit of Ubuntu um, yeah and remember that our mantra is with every hour the cockpit beckons whatever hour you can you know add onto your goal towards achieving your goal takes you closer to the attendance of to, takes you closer to attaining that goal so with every hour the cockpit beckons until next time in general you be here signing out and saying cheers